if you are looking to get away, Henry County Parks and Recreation probably has a trip for you. And joining me to talk about the upcoming travel plans is tour host Ernie Dale. Thank you so much for coming on. Well, thank you, Brittany. It's good to be here again. So let's jump right into it. A Valentine's train. Okay, this we're like taking a the train out of Roanoke. Getaway. So this will be our first trip where we've done the train from Roanoke. Okay. And we're going up to the Mickey Tavern in Charlottesville. The bus will pick us up here in the Walmarts in Roanoke at the Bonsack and the Clearbrook take us to the train station downtown so that way they don't have to worry about parking. Yeah. Get on the train, we go to Charlottesville, the bus meets us there, takes us over to Mickey Tavern where we have the Valentine lunch and it's the buffet that they all enjoy so much. And um, Waiters are dressed in period costumes and uh, really? so it's a okay. fun day for them. Yeah, that sounds like an experience. Um, next, a uh, show at the Barter Theater. Show the Barter Theater. Well, uh, at the Masonic uh, Theater. The Masonic Theater in Clifton Forge is the Barter Players doing right. the show okay. called A Facility for Living. Okay. And it's about an older folks home. And the play is takes place in the newly restored Masonic Theater in Clifton Forge. So this will be our first time of doing a bus trip over there to Clifton Forge for the Masonic Theater. It is so beautiful. We got the chance to go a couple months ago, and that theater mm -hmm. is just gorgeous. I've toured it inside, and it is a beautiful facility. Yeah, and this mm -hmm. is a comedy. Is that right? It is a comedy, yes. Okay. And we'll be taking lunch from the Roanoke. We'll, it's a dinner show, but we'll be taking our dinner from the Roanoke restaurant and okay. have it inside the theater in their ballroom, and they'll have that set up for us to eat dinner in there. Okay. Uh, next, the Highland Maple Festival. And that's coming up on March the 10th, where we have the Amish breakfast on that trip. Yeah. And they'll uh, get to the sugar camps over there in Highland County, the arts and crafts show. We go to that at the Highland School, mm -hmm. then go around the back roads, and they get to see all that area and through the sugar camps. An Amish breakfast is mm -hmm. worth all of it. It is. It is. Uh, I mean, so. anytime I have an opportunity to eat Amish food, mm -hmm. I do it. And then uh, you're going back to Mickey Tavern. March Easter. the 31st, okay. the Saturday before Easter, Easter is on April the 1st, okay. we will do our train trip up there again for Easter at Mickey Tavern. Okay, so, so you're going there a couple times within a few months. Yes. Must this be a popular one. one. Well, February 10th is getting lots of response. Okay. So it's getting up close to 30 right now. Is that why so, you were, you said, all right, let's go again? Yeah. Okay. So, and that way people that can't get on the one February 10th, hopefully can get on March 31st. And they don't even have to wait that long. That's, That's very right. nice. And then the mm -hmm. Cherry Blossom train to DC, I feel like that is one that is very popular. It is, April 7th and 8th. Okay. And we'll be doing it out of Roanoke this year. We've done that trip uh, for several years now out of Lynchburg. Mm -hmm. And this year the bus will take us out of, um, to the train station in Roanoke. Okay. Then we'll ride the train all the way to D.C. The bus meets us up there, takes us to the monuments, memorials, and the Smithsonian's and so forth. How, how early would you say in advance do we need to book? Because that seems like it's one that would be really popular. People have already started booking that one. Okay, so, so get on it. Yes. Um, so if they want to get in touch with you, um, there are two different phone numbers, right? That is correct. Okay, so reach out to those phone numbers. If you want a recap of this segment, you can definitely find it on our website. Go to DaytimeBlueRidge.com. Thank you so much. Okay, thank you, Brittany. Yeah.